Hi everybody, Tayson Rockefeller, Teton Valley Realty. I'm here at 1190 Kayak Loop in Victor, Idaho, courtesy Jackson Hall Sotheby's. This home is on 0.39 acres in the River Meadows development. River Meadows is between Victor and Driggs. There is a community water system and public sewer, as well as some open space to the front and rear of almost all the homes in the project. You can see some of that open space between us and the adjacent road running parallel to Kayak Loop. You can give an idea of the uh, distance between the homes and the density with the two homes that are side by side there. And that's consistent with most of the homes in the project. This particular home has a vacant lot on either side, both to the west and to the east. So you can get some perspective there. I'll take you into the, what I would call an oversized two car garage certainly deep enough for a full-size SUV and then some storage benches on the far wall here. A number of things this builder's done, uh, Genie garage door openers, insulated doors, Anderson windows. They've done the chemical stain siding that's intended to look like barnwood as well as the natural cedar that you can see here. It gives a nice contrasting look. Uh, tongue and groove on the soffits on the large front covered deck. And of course, we do have a rear deck as well. Take you into the front door and give you a lay of the three bed, two bath, 1,946 square feet inside. Engineered hardwood floors, vaulted ceilings here in the living area. Of course, this is LED lighting like you see in most all construction today. Nice contemporary styling with your cabinets, uh, granite countertops and stainless appliances. I believe this is an all electric home with an electric furnace. You can see this kind of walk-in pantry here. And electricity in the Teton Valley is relatively affordable as a function of hydroelectricity powering most of what we have here through our local cooperative, Fall River Electric. So giving you an idea on the spaces, I'll take you into the master bedroom first. Dining room here, of course, we walked into the living area of the home, small coat closet. I'll Make sure we get you in everywhere here inside. Forced air heat. The furnace is likely in the crawl space. No basement due to the high water table here in River Meadows, but generally doesn't cause any issues. Huge walk-in closet, all complete with the built-in shelves. Again, you've kind of got the floating vanity look, which adds a contemporary look to the overall style. Tile shower, linen closet, and water closet. Alder trim throughout, including the doors. Doors have kind of a matte finish. Get us a nice look. Okay, I'll take you to the spare bedrooms and a bath. Bath is straightforward, single vanity. Again, it's got the floating look still. Tub shower combo. Bedrooms here are basic, basic size, and Typical closet. Made sure to not waste any of that space in the framing stage. We'd like to see that. Top 
tile here in the mudroom slash laundry. So again, the laundry not included. You do have the sink basin and the upper cabinets. Electric water heater. I believe that's a 40 or 50 gallon, which should be ample for a home of this size. And then back out to the garage here. As I conclude the video, I will give you a view of the rear yard area. Currently, this home is not landscaped. That should be included in the purchase price of this new construct home. So open space here in the rear portion of the home. You do have some lots this way of, I believe that's rowboat loop which that home in the distance is on. I have a wide angle lens, so things are a little bit further out than they are in person. This could have a shed roof type cover on it. Currently it does not as planned for the sale of the home, but would be a nice addition here. Again, Taysen Rockefeller Teton Valley Realty 1190 Kayak Loop here in Victor, Idaho. Taysen, T-A-Y-S-O-N at tetonvalleyrealty.com, 208-709-1333. Thanks.